Parental Care, Wikipedia Article Audio Parental care is a behavioral and evolutionary strategy adopted by some animals, making a parental investment into the evolutionary fitness of their offspring. This strategy means that more effort is spent on a relatively small number of offspring to give each of them a high chance of surviving to reproduce, an opposite strategy is to produce a very large number of small offspring, often as eggs, which are left to fend for themselves. In groups of animals In insects In fish In birds in mammals, in humans, in amphibians, in evolutionary biology. Parental care is seen in many insects, notably the social insects such as ants, bees, and wasps, in certain fishes, such as the mouth brooders, widely in birds, and especially widely in mammals which share two major adaptations for care of the young, namely gestation and production of milk. Some insects, but especially the Hymenoptera, invest substantial effort in caring for their young. The type and amount of care varies widely. Solitary wasps such as the Potter wasps build nests for their young, provisioning them with food, often caterpillars, caught by the mother. The nests are then sealed, and the young live on the food until they leave the nest as adults. In contrast, social wasps and honeybees raise young in substantial colonies, with eggs laid mainly by queens, and the young cared for mainly by workers. Outside the Hymenoptera, parental care is found among the burying beetles and the magnificent salt beetle. Subdued forms of parental care are also seen in the Lepidoptera, as in butterflies that lay eggs where the offspring will be able to feed. Crickets have also been known to lay eggs in optimal environments for the young. Many species of Hemiptera take care of the young. In the Belostomatidae family there are examples of paternal care, for instance in the genus Abetus. Several different groups of fish have evolved parental care. The young may be guarded by either parent. Some fish such as pipefish, sea dragons, and sea horses have a form of male pregnancy, the female taking no part in caring for the young once she has laid her eggs. Males in other species may take a role in guarding the eggs before they hatch. Mouth brooding is the care given by some groups of fish to their offspring by holding them in their mouth for extended periods of time. Mouth brooding has evolved independently in several different families of fish including the cardenal fish, sea catfish, bagrid catfish, cichlids, snakeheads, jawfishes, gouramis, and aroanas. Birds are distinctive in the way they care for their young. In over 90% of birds, both parents help to care for the young. This pattern may have originated in the stem reptiles that gave rise to the birds, before they developed flight. Most birds, including passerines, have their young born blind, naked, and helpless, totally dependent for their survival on parental care. The young are typically raised in a nest, the parents catch food and regurgitate it for the young. Some birds such as pigeons create a crop milk which they similarly regurgitate. David Lack developed a hypothesis that clutch size has evolved in response to the costs of parental care known as Lack's principle. It has since seen modifications but is still used as a general model. All the higher mammals share two major adaptations for care of the young, namely gestation and production of milk. These imply a group-wide choice of a degree of parental care. Many mammals go much further, building a nest, digging a burrow, or feeding and guarding the young, often for a prolonged period. 
Parenting or child rearing in humans is the process of promoting and supporting the physical, emotional, social, financial, and intellectual development of a child from infancy to adulthood. This goes far beyond anything found in other animals, including not only the provision of food, shelter, and protection from threats such as predators, but a prolonged period of support during which the child learns whatever is needed to live successfully in human society. Six modes of parental care are recognized among the amphibia, in different species, egg attendance, egg transport, tadpole attendance, tadpole transport, tadpole feeding, and internal gestation in the oviduct. In evolutionary biology, parental investment is the expenditure of time and effort that benefits offspring at a cost to parents' ability to invest in other components of fitness. It forms part of one kind of reproductive strategy, choosing to give each of a relatively small number of offspring a relatively high chance of surviving long enough to reproduce themselves and may accordingly be accompanied by the production of a small number of zygotes at a time, possibly only one.